After surgery, expect a great deal of swelling. A significant amount of the initial swelling, however, is typically gone after the first two to three weeks. Also, the amount of swelling can differ a little bit from one side to the other. A little bit only. If it's a lot, which is very, very uncommon, this is something you need to let us know about. Swelling is often quite extreme in the upper parts of the breast, creating quite an impressive, albeit fake, breast look. Not surprisingly, many women like this. Depending on your pre-existing anatomy, this swelling often creates a very unusual look to your breast as well. Now, if your breasts were a little bit droopy prior to surgery, this can create quite a long breast appearance with a lot of swelling up top and your nipples still sitting a little bit low. Do not panic, because once the swelling settles down, so too will this odd look. Also, if the bottom of your breast are quite tight, so you have a very short distance from your breast fold to your nipple, this tightness will exist immediately post-op and will be even more noticeable, especially with the upper pole fullness. You can't expect a nice underboob immediately after surgery when you've got a very tight bottom part of your breast initially. But over time, things will settle down, the swelling from the top will come down, and the underboob will settle out and stretch out, resulting in a nice breast shape. But it takes a while.